Yeah, I mean, where do you start? I mean, you have two guys that uh, can score 50 in a playoff game. You have one guy that's a triple-double machine that uh, loves to get guys involved. Uh, you know, so you go down the mer- myriad of list of myriad of things you can do uh, defensively. Uh, you have to check off some things that you don't really want to do um, because of both their ability to, to score and Jokic's ability to create something um, kind of off script. Uh, but look, this is what the finals is about. You're, it, I said it before game one. You're not playing ducks. You're not playing you know easy competition. Uh, you have to find a way to overcome it, even if great players are playing great. Uh, and we've proven that. We can win... Uh, and overcome uh, regardless uh, of how the game is going. I would, uh, an ideal situation would be if it's on our terms and, and we're controlling the tenor of the game, uh, but we've also won games where we, we haven't been able to do that for, for the entire game. Uh, at, at the end of the day, it still ended up in, in a loss. So, uh, yes, we felt like there's some things that we could do better you know, defensively, but the game may be totally different in game two. We have to be open to the competition and do whatever is necessary. Uh, in terms of the shooters, that's pretty simple. Let it fly. Ignite. You know, once those, they see two go down, it can be three, it can turn into six, just like that. Uh, as long as uh, we're getting those kind of clean looks, you know, that's what matters. And then obviously uh, we want to have a little bit more balance with our attacks and, and pain opportunities uh, against a team that does a good job taking it away.